Hey guys, I'm Aaron LaVoy of Midwestern Hoof Trimmer. I'm doing a lot of videos with feet like this where people say, well, maybe they wouldn't be so bad if they weren't walking in their own manure, or maybe they wouldn't be so bad if this or that. But this foot is really not bad at all. See, hoof trimming is an act of corrective wearing. And the only thing wrong with this hoof is it's not wearing perfectly. And just to clarify, for those who've asked, it doesn't hurt the cow at all getting her trim like this. So like I said, hoof trimming being an act of corrective wearing, she's not wearing as much here as she should be, and she's not wearing as much to the inside on this claw as she should be. And I'd like to point out there's a big difference between cows that don't have a problem and cows that are as comfortable as possible. She does not have a problem, but this uneven wear will make her not quite as comfortable as possible. And that's my goal, prevention and as comfortable as possible. And the farms are doing everything they can to keep the cows that way. And as far as the extra manure on their feet, know that the pens that the cows live in are not covered in manure. However, right before they get into our machine, they have to be confined into a smaller pen. And those smaller pens get dirty fast. And we even clean that pen in between each group of eight or nine cows. But when nine cows have been in there for almost an hour, it gets a little messy. So I'm going to trim this foot up for you and show you the difference between not lame and as comfortable as possible. All right, now we've got most of the hoof that was not wearing off perfectly removed. Her balance is restored. And now we're just doing a little bit of prevention to keep her from acquiring something like a white line lesion or an ulcer. Now you don't have to check all of this little bit of dirt. The crevice is removed and there's nothing underlying there. This is pigmentation, it's nothing to worry about at all. Just like the rest of the cow is white and black. And this dishing that I'm doing here, that's to allow manure to pass freely between the toes and to help keep the brief from getting packed on the axial walls. All right, now we have a foot that is as comfortable as possible and prevented from having a future problem. We'll do one more because there's a few more things I'd like to explain. First off, this is the oldest group of cows on this farm. This farm milks about 1,500 cows. And you can see the feet are still in really good condition. That is because we do maintenance and we keep them in nice condition. These cows are trimmed roughly three times a year using the criteria that we provide the farmers. Sometimes they wear even less and accumulate more hoof in the problem areas. So don't let the lame cow videos skew your opinion of the dairy industry into thinking that most of the cows are lame and have problems. Most of the cows are just like this one. And this is what we spend the majority of our days doing. But for some reason, people enjoy watching the problem videos more than the nice clean trims. I'd also like to point out that we always trim all four feet on every cow. I normally am in the front and Pedro is normally in the rear and the majority of my videos are on front feet just because I have better positioning for my camera and better lighting. But note that every cow that enters the machine gets all four hooves maintenance trimmed every time, unless they have a major problem with their leg or a joint. That would be the only time that we would avoid trimming all four hooves. We well, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Till next time, catch you on the flip-flop. Bye.